This is Mike Outram in December, confined to a bed one month after a tragic accident left him paralyzed from the neck down. I was told they, they'd be pleased if I was able to do three steps, so... This is Mike Outram today. His steps are slow and a little off balance, but what he's accomplished in eight months is nothing short of a miracle. Seven months ago, he could barely move his finger, and now, and now he's walking. <laughs> yeah, so it's awesome. The coach of 30 years was demonstrating a dismount on the trampoline when his head hit the bottom of the pit. I left totally paralyzed from the neck down, and when I laid on the bed and came in, I told my mother, I, well, I can't be this way, there's no way. That's kind of how I coach, and I hope to be back to coaching as well. And he says his determination to coach again brought him to where he is now. I've always had an active lifestyle. I've I've always worked with children, so I hope to return to it soon. Outram has been in Toronto for the last six months undergoing therapy, and today he came back to Windsor, where he will undergo intensive rehab with the goal to fully integrate him back into the community. To get him back into a home setting as functionally independent as we possibly can. Outram says he'll be focusing a lot of his energy on his arms. To get a lot more function in my arms, like I, this is as far as I can go, so if I fall, I can't get my arms out to even catch me. It's going to be a tree. And they didn't like that. I used to say that. When I'm falling, you want me to yell timber for you? And they're like, no, we don't want you to fall.